Taurus, April 2022. Started laying your cards. Ooh, that one wanted to come out right there. Taurus, Taurus, too many cards. Just one, please. One at a time. Beautiful. Came out again. Okay, that one came out. All right, Taurus. So at the center of your reading is some form of communication. Most, mostly um, this card comes up with writing or texts or some kind of message. It could be a formal message, a letter in the mail. It could be a text message. Um, could be a document as well, some kind of paperwork. Um, Seems like there's a new beginning for someone in your life. And um, it has to do with the privacy of the family or an actual home of the family. This is very much family card here. It could have to do with a child. It could have to do with the beginnings of an illness or the start of some kind of health issues. And it doesn't seem, so this is like illness of, uh, paper that is the answer. Securing a paper that is the answer. It feels like there's some kind of information. This could be a pregnancy test. I don't see anything about pregnancy other than the child. So it, it's very much a generalized reading. So it could go with a health test. It could be anything from, you know, blood work document, um, some kind of some kind of hard copy of some kind of information that is either it also could be about someone sacrificing something in their will for you or writing writing you a gift or legally giving you a gift um, this also could be someone deeding their house to you or communication about some kind of sacrifice having to do with and, and you'll get this communication at a gathering or a meeting. A meeting, a new meeting, a new gathering. There is a start to something gathering, maybe a building of a tradition as well within the family. You'll be meeting this woman there. I don't know who she is to you. Um, she would be a woman who is spiritual and she would be someone that unlocks pathways for you, opens 
doors for you. Um, she'd be somebody who has the answers for things. Um, there's also this security or long-term kind of contractual thing with this situation. Maybe this is a, you securing a home. And there's a sacrifice within the formal agreement or there is kind of a problem with the lease or you have an issue with the lease agreement um, and you talk about this at a gathering. So this woman could be leaving her daughter some or son, some property. And there's a stipulation. Um, if this is your new home, it would be strong, well built, and it, it'll be older because it's been around for a while. If it's not older, it will be well made. It will have staying power. And It will be quiet, probably, or at least there'll be a room in the house where one can, they might have a library or an office within the home. If you're looking, if your mother's no longer at her home anymore and is in care or not with us anymore, um, whatever paper you're looking for, if you are looking for a paper that will help you with her, you know, taking care of her stuff for her. Um, it would be in an office for sure. Um, and there is this If you have been having any health problems, this woman would be the woman you would go to and the family to talk about it. Um, any troubles that you've had, not even just health, but like any troubles going to this woman would be the one that you would go to normally. She's the, the key to the family. She's the one that keeps, keeps you all rooted. She secures things, holds things down. She also might be a writer or a paralegal of some kind. You two are connected through writing in some way. There's a securing of an answer as well, a securing of a new path. So whatever contractual troubles or if this is to do with a home and a landlady um, would be resolved or would come to a, a decent conclusion. I see a man being also in the picture. He's the underlying card or at least the man representing understanding. So an understanding of, of knowledge or the law or secrets being some kind of subtle subtlety within the situation. So overall, this being about some form of contract or writing, um, a house of writing, this woman could be a publisher or work as an agent for a publishing house. And she's the one that's going to be the answer to you getting roots within your career. Um, or if she's a doctor, she would be the one 
helping you through this situation by having the answers about your health or finding the secret component that helps you solve a health issue or better betters your health. Um, this also could be a personal trainer um, that really helps you out and gets you in shape. Um, Trouble with writing or contracts meetings. So there could be some issues. If you were having any law, legal issues about anything, this lady would be the one, this lawyer, this person that's helping you would be the one to go to. Um, the answer is in this meeting up and there is a securing of or a career of sacrifice. So she may be a social worker. Um, she may be someone who services, she, she services others. She, she um, dedicates herself to others. She's dedicated, this woman. the start of health. This could very well be like a, a better, a wellness center, even if it's a therapist. There's an awareness of secrets and changes or endings. This also could be an awareness of, of writing or books, literature. And awareness of how to end a book. An editor, this woman could be an editor the answers to legacy or a body of writing. If you're writing about health, this one will be very helpful. Um, Taurus, this is very interesting. If this is about a pregnancy, which there, there's not too many cards here. There's family and there's a child and there's a woman and there's a man. So. If a man is in the picture or hasn't been in the picture and there's been a sacrifice, well, it would be a sacrifice to, to this child by this woman because she'd be raising the child by herself, but this situation would be about legal stuff to do with where the, where the child cust custodial things. and. And the start of a contract having to do with planting roots and, and family. And a woman is the answer to the family. So most likely the woman would get, keep the rights and the man would have written or knowledge of some sort of ending with something. What is this ending about? Or his privileges would be lessened or he would have less custody. So the home that is a sacrifice to the family. There might be also issues with the home and who's staying where. Um, the child stays at the home. Um, the woman's home. So 
and that's going to be better for the family. There's going to be growth there. There's going to be opportunity. Also, this home is, is you know, in a nice... There's family there. There's, it's might be better for her to be there. Um, a career of writing is the answer. So this is either custodial, legal, um, contractual stuff going on with your home or your health um, or career. And it all looks pretty pretty good. I would be aware of any a man might secretly go quiet. That's the one thing I'm seeing that looks troubling. Um, so if there was any kind of test that was done um, and this information was conveyed to this person that, you know, somebody was having a child or yada yada, um, he may go quiet on you. I don't see negativity here. I see a lot of positivity. The only trouble I see is this kind of sacrifice or this burden of this also might be a burden of your childhood um, that you've carried with you. And it also could be the start of troubles with this woman. So another way of looking at this could be you start having troubles with someone that you live with in your home. Um, in the beginning, it was a stable home. Um, there might have been some troubles with or difficulties or strife with communication um, about gatherings uh, or not getting an invitation to something is another thing. Not getting an invitation to something. If this is the beginning of some kind of the answer is at the beginning. So whatever this situation is, the key to unlocking it or, or getting over whatever trials you have with it is at the start of the situation itself. So go back to that time and try to trace your steps backwards. Maybe go back to your childhood. So any troubles that you may be having may have to do with your subconscious mind and how you were brought up or something you experienced in childhood. Um, You might end up having some troubles as an adult and have to go back home and stay there for a bit. Or this may have already happened because this is in the past. And you're having a difficulty um, maybe with communicating with somebody that you used to be close to. And the letters and the mail are your form of gathering. This might just mean that there's like a bunch of paperwork that needs to be gone through and worked out with this situation. I 
I, this also could be a nanny situation, a live-in nanny situation. So if you're looking for a nanny for your children, I see this as kind of like you find your Mary Poppins kind of situ kind of thing. She might be strict. But she'll be the answer to your to your plight. She'd be strong in one way or another. Or at least she'd have staying power. If this is, I'm looking for somebody to be a part of my family. Or This woman might be the answer to helping the family be more secure. So if you are a single father and you've met somebody, you may find the person that's going to be good for your family. Um, I also see... This could be a heavy group, group gathering, or a heavy message. That's brought up or if this has to do with career, it could be like a kind of a big deal contract. Um, that's brought up at a meeting at work. It has to do with securing some sort of roots. You're securing something. There's something formal about it. Um, it's the start to planting roots. And it might have to do with the home of this woman. And that's about all I have for you, Taurus. I hope you have a great month. I'll talk to you again next month. Bye.